are you going to do for me? I'm sorry I couldn't talk to you earlier. Yeah, you acted like you hardly knew who I was. Well, I have to, don't I? <laughs> this is doing my head in a bit. We're supposed to be like lovers, right? And I have to stand outside your door like a prick and go no further. Why don't you come upstairs and let, let me introduce you to my guests? As what? Come back later. I want you to stay the night. I'll leave the door open. That's very lax, that is. Please, Lloyd. Don't watch me. Why not? I'm better at a uniform. That's what I'm waiting for. I'll see you later. Oh, oh, well, look, look, hang on a minute. Hang on, I'm ready myself now, actually. Oh, um, well, shouldn't you wait a bit? What for? Well, so you other residents don't see us leaving together. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tongue will. I'll go and relieve the other guard. Aren't you going to say goodbye to me properly? No. Whose rules, Lloyd? Look, you and the other residents pay me to do one thing, remember? You got a contract with my company. So bloody what? If we carry on like this, our relationship's never going to get serious. Are you going to lose your job because of it? Well, get another bloody job. Come on, say goodbye to me properly. I think you visited enough department stores already. Oh. Sound like a husband. Actually, I bought you a present. Do you want to see it? Later, Hillary. It's a t-shirt. Do you normally shop here? Well, sometimes, but I just thought that, you know, it would be quite nice to, um, well, you know. See me? Well, yes, why not? I'll come and watch you at work tomorrow, shall I? Uh, lady shoes is that way, madam. I'm sorry, Lord. Let me have a peek at my present then. Oh, nice. That's my car. As soon as I get here, she shows me the present and then makes me wear it. 
just looks so nice. She's a control freak at work, too. I am not a control freak. She bosses all her clients about. Oh, come on, Henry. You get other people off the hook. What's your defence about you? Um, I'm going to get the main course. Uh, that won't <laughs> do! <laughs> <laughs> I was on the rebound from somewhere. Do you know Gary and Nicky, the food critic? She never stopped boasting about it. I had to drop him. He was too old for me. Lucky one. bitch. <laughs> are you, I have to go home with Richard. Richard. You'll be under the this covers with Denzel Washington. Can you fix up for He's good company. Carling after the rug up? Well, well don't you think? Gemma. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's going fine. <laughs> Lloyd's looking a bit blank. Tell him what you do, Richard. Oh, Henley, Twickenham, the cricket. If companies want a day out for their clients, I put a package together and organise it for them. So middle-aged men can drink champagne in a marquee whilst watching it on TV. What about you, Lloyd? Oh, it's uh, hush hush. Oh, really? He's a security consultant. That's right. <laughs> and uh, what does that mean? Exactly. Well, I, um... I advise firms on measures that they can take. Uh... Closed-circuit television, surveillance... Uh, what else? Um... Crime prevention, generally. Beware of dog. <laughs> I suppose it's the future, really, isn't it? Ivory towers. Not so much being out of touch as being untouchable. Not too happy with the firm we're with at the moment. Perhaps we should arrange a meeting. Come up with something to stop the riffraff trying to sneak into our tents, eh? Why Julia's driving home? She's more pissed than he is. What did you think? She had more than three units, so technically the amount of alcohol in her budget. No, about them. Wasn't it more important what they thought about me? You too. Well, you obviously. All that bollocks about me being a security consultant. Well, you supplied most of the bollocks. You didn't give me any choice. I just went along with it because I didn't want to make a fool of you. No, I'm sorry. Don't know what made me do it. I do. You think you want me. What you want is someone your friends are going to feel comfortable with. Well, I'm sorry I don't earn 70 grand a year. And I'm sorry my car ain't as new as yours. And I'm sorry I'm just a black guy that gives you a good time in bed! Well, maybe you're not being as sarcastic as you think. You could have told them you were a security guard, but you went along with the other version, not because it was easier, but because it sounded better and you preferred it. I ain't got a problem with what I am! Yes, you have. That's why you're getting so angry. Really? What's this? An education you're giving me now. Look, look, there's nothing wrong with feeling that you're capable of more. Don't you patronise me. <laughs> you already told your oh. friends I was somebody else. Oh. Well, maybe I was trying to protect you. <sighs> protect me? Pro protect me from what? From them taking the piss? From them thinking I was ridiculous? Or is that what you really think? <sighs> Fucking bitch. Look, I'm even wearing a fucking T-shirt you chose for me. 